evening, everyone, and welcome to Christmas with the Celts. <laughs> this evening, we're going to play for you some ancient Irish and Scottish uh, carols and hymns and um, all sorts of songs and tunes from as far back as the 15th century. Some more contemporary ones you might be more familiar with, and some we've even written ourselves. And uh, so hopefully you'll bear with us. We'll do our best. You know. But it's fantastic to be here. Wonderful to celebrate the greatest season of them all with you here tonight. Thanks for coming out and seeing us. This is an original uh, called Nola Corner, which means Happy Christmas in Gaelic.
All right, this is one you'll recognize. It's actually in English.
Thank you very much. This next song you may be familiar with, it kind of becomes the national anthem of Ireland every Christmas time. It was written by a man named Shane McGowan, who's, uh, who was the founder and singer of the band called The Pogues, which you may have heard of. But the song is called Fairy Tale in New York. So hope you like it. They were singing, we kissed on the corner and danced through the night. And the boys in the NYPD choir were singing the whole day. And the bells are ringing out for Christmas Day. That's your cue, it's time to clap your hands because it's Christmas. Slug on junk, lying there almost dead, like grip on the bed. You scumbag, you mad, you're you cheap and you're haggard. That hurts. Happy Christmas, my arse, and I thank God it's our last. And the boys of the NYPD choir were singing Galway Bay. And the bells are ringing out for Christmas Day. It's when you clap your hand. Oh, yeah, you're in this show. Someone. Well, so could anyone. You took my dreams from me when I first found you. I kept them with me, babe. I put them with my own. Can't make it all alone. I, I built, built my, my dreams, dreams around you. With the boys in the NYPD choir, the city all the day. And the bells are ringing out for Christmas Day. Oh, yeah! We got a reason to celebrate, don't we, tonight? I'm pretty good. It's okay if I dance. I'm not a very good dancer, but I'll try it. It feels powerful to do that. <laughs> so you've 
heard about a place called Dublin, I'm sure. So we were hearing about New York there. Has anybody ever been to Dublin? There's a few of you there. Anybody here from Dublin? You never know this. You never know. But uh, so there, I used to work in an area called Temple Bar. You may have visited there when you were over there. There's a lovely little pub there called the Temple Bar. And uh, I used to spend a fair bit of time in there. I spent most of my paycheck in there, unfortunately. Oh. But, <laughs> and, uh, but I just remember one afternoon sitting in the bar and noticed a couple of men in the corner having a conversation and just happened to earwig in a little bit, as is one's want when you're in a pub, having a quiet pint, you know. And uh, one fellow says to the other, he's like, you know, uh, so where are you from? Are you just visiting for the day or do you live here? He's like, oh, no, I'm from Ina, County Clare. Uh, just up for the day, doing a bit of shopping. He says, you're joking, I'm doing the same thing. I'm from Ina as well. And uh, what class were you in in school? Like, what school did you go to even, you know? And he says, oh, it's St. Mary's. And uh, I was in, uh, I graduated in 84. He's like, you're kidding, so did I. That's ridiculous. What are the odds? How come we don't know each other? He says, who is your teacher? Mrs. McGuinness. Mrs. McGuinness, she was my teacher as well. This is weird. Then a fellow walks in off the street, goes up to the barman, says, I'll have a pint. Any, any, uh, any news tonight? The barman says, ah, just the usual. The Murphys are, the Murphy twins are drunk again, you know? <laughs> Carrie. <laughs> Make me sing the double Christmas blues. 
so much. Oh, yeah. So, Patrick, you're going to Ireland this Christmas, are you? No, I'm playing gigs with you, Rick. <laughs> I forgot, sorry. <laughs> This next tune comes from the Scottish Shetland Islands. And there's a beautiful tradition there that dates back to the 15th century as well, uh, where a fiddler will walk from house to house at dawn playing this tune. And the tune's called Dade Dawes, and it means darkness is past and a new day dawns. Welcome the light. And Louise is going to play for us now.
Scottish Christmas Carol dates back to the 1300s. It speaks of when the angel Gabriel comes to the Virgin Mary to let her know that she'll be giving birth to the Christ child. This is called Balu Lalu.
Well, thank you very much. We've almost reached the end of the first half, would you believe? We well, can never believe how quickly this thing goes. It's, uh, it's pretty great. But, <laughs> but I don't know, did that last tune, did it stir your Celtic blood? I think <laughs> it does mine anyway. So, uh, yeah, thanks for being here. And uh, remember to check out the, uh, the merchandise and all that, you know, that's all very important. But also, just to mention, it is extremely nice to be playing in front of a live audience again, I have to say that. It's been a while. So thanks, everybody, for being here. Uh, and do we have any of uh, Irish heritage here? Uh, I don't know about you, Patrick, that didn't sound like any Irish I've ever heard. <laughs> there we are now. <laughs> <laughs> Do we have any Irish uh, heritage people here tonight? <laughs> ah, it's the Irish I know. <laughs>
vocals. Timo Bellanueva on the bass. There's plenty of nice, fond memories, and I'm sure a lot of you have similar ones. In preparation for Christmas, just the, uh, the memories of the, the smell of Christmas cake and Christmas pudding being made. I don't know, does anybody here know what real Christmas cake and Christmas pudding is? Where it's like a fruit cake, except it tastes a million times better, right? <laughs> it's not fruit cake at all. It's got whiskey in it and all sorts of delicious things like that. <laughs> But, uh, and you cover it in hot custard and fresh whipped cream and things like this. It's lovely. But um, there's also lovely traditions where, you know, you see some of the houses around the country here with the candle in the window, which is uh, a tradition from Christmas Eve um, in Ireland. I'm sure lots of other places too, but in Ireland where the youngest girl in the family who would be named Mary quite often would have the privilege of lighting the candle in the window and you'd leave the door off the latch to welcome in strangers who wouldn't uh, have a place for the night on Christmas Eve. And uh, so that kind of leads into our next song, which is Doniha um, Udi uh, Mehel, which means that night in Bethlehem.
Samarian, ladies and gentlemen. You guys are a great audience. Wow. This is our first time here, and wow. Would you have us back? All right, good night. <laughs> no, this is, this is fantastic. Uh, we'd love to come back. Uh, tonight is a special night. You've got, uh, there is a, there are a handful of really incredible Ilan Pipers. Uh, in the world, and uh, he's not one of them. <laughs> no, Patrick is, uh, has played with some people. Uh, you may have heard some of these names. Uh, some guy named Sting. Uh, he's also 
played with some other, he's got a weird name, uh, Bono. I know. Yeah. I uh, Never heard of him. <laughs> give us some others. <laughs> no, not Enya. If you know her number, give, let me know. <laughs> Patrick Darcy and the Pipes. Thank you. from 
Uh, the dancers flew in from Ireland, uh, <laughs> Ohio. <laughs> That's the uh, O'Hare Dance School. Aren't they brilliant? Yeah, they're fantastic, aren't they? Mm -hmm. Wow. Did you guys have a good Thanksgiving? It's a great thing about the holidays. You know, we've, uh, uh, we've all, not just this country, but the world has been through a very difficult past couple of years. But if we, uh, we look through history, 100 years ago, the world went through something very similar, actually even worse, as far as death toll. But the positive thing is we come out of those things oftentimes stronger, and oftentimes with a different perspective as far as what's valuable. And I think we learn to come back and really value things such as, especially when you've lost someone, you know, you come back and you really take time to value your family members and to be thankful for our blessings. That's the good thing that comes out of this. in Ireland, I'm sure it happened here too, does it still happen where carolers travel around through neighborhoods, going from door to door, singing songs, singing Christmas carols, it's just a lovely tradition, um, not seen so much anymore, I don't know, I think it was a beautiful thing, I always remember they would sing uh, one particular song, 
that would make the hair stand up at the back of my neck. And not because they were such terrible singers, but because it was such a beautiful song. <laughs> um, uh, oh, Holy Night. Just a beautiful melody, and beautiful song. And written in France, apparently. We, we learned this afternoon on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> That's the, the next song we'll do now. Sing along with us. We're doing a Christmas carol tonight. Oh, holy night, the stars are brightly shine. Sitting at a park, and he appeared for so far as we
So tonight happens to be the anniversary of uh, a great songwriter you may have heard of. Um, he was very, came to a very tragic end, the poor man, um, but John Lennon um, died 40, what was it, 41 years ago today, I think it was. And uh, so it just so happens we're going to sing a John Lennon song up next and we're going to be joined by this wonderful choir. Welcome them, please. The song is... So this is Christmas What have we done Another year over A new one's begun Thank you. 
So repeat after me. Santa Claus is coming to town. 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 Amazing. Santa Claus is coming to town. Keep it up. Santa Claus is coming to town. Santa Claus is coming to town. out of a job. Making spirits bright 
Patrick. It's gone by really fast. Wow. I can't believe it. Thank you all so much for being here and coming to see Christmas with the Celts. It's just been a wonderful evening celebrating the greatest season of them all with you. Um, remember this Christmas, be nice to your dysfunctional family members and overeat and overdrink and all those things that are good for us at the holiday season. And uh, say your prayers and go to bed early. Thank you. <laughs> Right. And Merry Christmas and Happy Christmas if you say Happy Christmas. Thank you very yeah. much. Merry Christmas. All right, this is a this is a tune we wrote ourselves. That's all for uh, oh, the Nashville Celt CD, right? There it goes.